All right, friends, we're back with another week of Core Keeper. What is this, three? Like four or five now. Oh, boy. Well, the Pokedex will know the truth. Because we did at least two weeks on the late time, and now this is the second one on the early time. Uh, I guess... I'm good on food. We need the Scarlet Ore, essentially. Let me bring a backup pick. Oh, that's. Uh, I think you can only mine Scarlet Ore with an Iron Pick, so never mind. <clears throat> so we need to make a drill, essentially, and a robot arm and a uh, conveyor system. And if we can get all that started, we can start drilling out some pretty nice areas. Start. Uh, What's it called? Passive income stream? Yep. Well, how you been? Uh, very busy at work the past couple days. Really? Interesting. More so than usual. Interesting, interesting. What's got you guys so vexed? Uh, a lot of things happening at once, and especially today when the building manager is off work. I suppose so... that would make your job a little more difficult yeah thorns damage what's that sounds cool i assume that's when you get hit you hurt your opponent right that's normally what thorn is either that or some kind of you hit them and then I don't know, but they run into another enemy and it hurts them. I don't know. That could work. Yeah, that just gets more armor. Okay. He can get it. Okay, my armor's good. Gotta get two more souls. What are you collecting souls for? What is this, Dark Souls now? For the... In the character menu. Where you get the souls, like you got the soul of Azios. Oh, Azios. Well, we don't have the soul of Azios. We need to go get it. That's why we're going to the Azios Wildlands. Well, I guess we're gonna get three more souls then. We gotta find out what the other two souls are. Sure. shovel wasn't a great move on my part but what are you using a shovel for cleaning up the slime brigade on the way uh, so i'm trying to make it so that the slimes don't uh, jump in our path while we're running i was it up here Oh, here we go. You explore here? What is all this? Where you at? Oh yeah, that's the place where I fought a bunch of enemies while you were doing things. Yeah. At the end of last one. But there's one of those big troll guys here. There's two, at least two of them. if I can take him out with just like fireball spray. I like that. Oh, I did get him. Yeah. Wreck. Gotta 
head over to you. Yeah, I was farming magic over in that area, just killing everything with the fire staff. It's also not a bad plan. Especially since I can just fix the fire staff with just basic wood. got cut. That would have been bad. Oh, Jesus. There's so many here now. What happened? Yeah, there's a lot of enemies left back there. Yeah. Yeah, I'm in a lot of trouble. Almost there. Do not die. Hey, bring fire. I need a lot of it. Certainly a great way of leveling vitality, that's for sure. There's three fire, three of the giant trolls, I'm sure. Yes, I know. I've been circling them and avoiding them while killing all the smaller ones. You're insane, dude. Just, there we go. All three's dead. And they drop a good amount of ores. Here's a fire mage. Caveling toilet. Now that's what we need back at base. I haven't taken a poop this whole game. Hey, speaking of leveling vitality, I just did. It's a nice little loot area, at least. And another copper mine. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Oh, here's another one. I don't think we can get over there right now. Oh, that was something we can break. Oh, 
See, it's like a display table. Just over here. Is this somebody's house? Where on the left? Yeah. Yeah, I've already been there. Okay. I cleared that last week, I think. I recall you saying you were clearing a house. Sure. I just didn't take the treasure chest. Didn't Greyhawk the area, huh? That's okay. No, I just stuff stuff inside of it, the actual important stuff. Here's another drillable spot. This place ain't bad. Got uh, two big ones down here. Where are the small ones coming from? Are they spawning somewhere? Oh, here, take this. Battle axe. Yeah, I've got one. They're really good. Why don't they just spawn in the dark? Because you just came out of nowhere. Which? They must just spawn in the dark or something, because that one literally just came from this left side where we already cleared out. Okay. I mean, I try to leave a line of candles behind me, you know? We've already figured out that the map won't update unless you have it lit up, yeah. Seems like light is a far more important mechanic than it originally advertised all right well i'm heading over to the place where we actually get the orders that we really need scarlet although i mean nothing wrong with a bit of bit of iron oh and here's a iron drillable Side. I almost had the eco dream again, and I woke up. You never have the eco dream. I always have the That's eco dream. Thing. I'm the only one that does have the eco dream. It's maddening. Pretty light, so I can kill you in a lighter space. No, you didn't drop my hand. Rage, rage. 
Hmm, it's a lot cleaner. Yeah, you're better than the copper. Except you don't give armor, but you give me more health, so that's good. Well, I hit 25 vitality <laughs> and four ranged. I'm not such a ranged madman like you. No, that means you can get to the next level, next row of skills on your next at 30. So, all right. I don't even know what the second level of vitality can get you. Guess we're gonna find out. I have wood in my inventory? Oh, I probably got some from the enemies. Oh, this is definitely going to be the first thing that we mine. Scarlet? Yeah. <laughs> I feel like drilling this drills dividends because it means we can get more Scarlet, get more drills to drill more things, to do more drilling, to do more things. Well, I'll tell you what. How you want it to work. Three days ago, I really hurt my knee. Uh, I switched to new shoes lately. And I'm pretty sure they messed me up real bad. Like, I could barely walk. It was like the old days that I used to complain about. And uh, I switched the insoles back to my old shoes, and I feel so much better now after a couple of days of icing for, like, multiple hours a day. That sounds like you know what you need to wear. Oof. Yo, I mean, I already ordered a copy of them. You know what I mean? Like, uh, another set of Merrells. Uh, it doesn't hurt anymore, but it is super inflamed, like, golf ball-sized inflammation. It's kind of scary. After we're done here, I gotta go take some more acetaminophen. That's a cool name for Tylenol. A cool generic name. You're a cool generic guy. Oh. I'm glad I recognized that that was you. And not somebody to murder. I was getting ready to murder. I was on I'm murder the, mode. I'm wearing the caveling garb now because it's better than the copper garb. You could wear iron like me. It's not that we yeah, don't. But I like the dodge chance and range damage boost it gives me. Sure. Because well, the hood gives me melee damage. The chest plate gives me range damage. What the heck? Oh. I found somebody's house. Just happened upon it. Oh, I got another crystal skull shard. Did we ever find out what we get when we get ten of those? Uh, You make something out of it, right? Isn't that what it says? No, it just says materials. Ten crystal skull shards on the bottom. Only the fraction of something bigger, so yeah, I guess we make something, but... That's what I thought. Do we even know where to make it? No idea. Alright, we've got some new equipment here. I don't know if we can even use these, but here's a tent and a mattress. Doesn't seem like it. Looks like it's just decorative stuff. An abandoned makeshift tent. Who would have lived here? Looks cool, though. 
It doesn't say decorative like some of the other things. Ooh, what's these red? Is that just... Oop. Can you clear these out of my way? Okay, here we go. Oh, and then I'm gonna... Doesn't look like there's anything here with the red sparkles, but... Might just be the, um... I've got something down by me. Bugs in this area. Yeah, there's definitely dudes ahead and then uh, a lake. Look at this friendly fire. All right, hold on. This will be the last one. Okay, go, 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 go. Wow, they survived multiple axe hits. And plenty of whatever you got. Still just using the basic fire stuff. Oh, we didn't even have to dig through that. There's a wrap around here. Yeah, but you know I'm going to dig in a straight line anyway. That's just who I am yeah. this week. Hey, you know what? It's very quick and brainless to get here and there. All right? Let's you just go. Oh, what? Oh, hi. You good? good for you. Yep, you're an enemy. You didn't glow in the dark. I'm supposed to know you're an enemy if you don't glow in the dark. I'm sorry our enemies aren't obliging to you. We're very southern as I say that. <laughs> the enemy's over there just going, bless your heart. Oh, I got a mechanical arm. Yeah, you can sell them. That's all they're useful I I for. From, but I got a mechanical arm. Ooh. Probably. Ooh, what the heck? From looting a chest. Um. There's a plant that traps you in its place. Okay, you good? Yeah, I got out eventually, but. Walk over to that plant right there. No, I'm not. I don't want to get trapped in it. Oh. It's like jackass. You're like, hey, what if you punch yourself it in the nuts? Like reached out and grabbed me and just stuck me in place for like five seconds. I'm like, no, Lawson, I don't want to get punched in the nuts. A seed that only grows in mold. A fungi seed. Ah. That's weird. Does imply that there's going to be a mold dungeon. Break this grass ground. I don't need that. Oh, there's more enemies up here. Got another house over here. Looks like it's got crops. There's a mine spot here. I gotta come all the way around since you didn't fill that spot in. I'm hearing a lot of complaints. Now this fence is getting in your way. You're just perfectly straight line. I mean, I'm gonna annihilate it. Thing. It was nice and peaceful before we got here. What the heck? That's a big version of this plant. There's another Scarlet over here. Scarlet drill site. There's another thing up here, too. It does seem that way. And then there's gold up here. Is that gold or iron? Ooh, and there's an enemy. That looks like tin, actually. Might be. 
orange-ish, so I guess it's supposed to be. That's that grab in it, There's a uh, ore this way. I'm very, very low on pickaxe strength, so might have to make a run back. We should have enough to maybe make the beginnings of the drill. I hope. This is just a grove up here. Very nice looking. Hey, the game does ha do some very good job with scenery, given that it's not a 3D game. Yeah, it's got atmosphere. It's got moves like Dagger. Oh, I'm trapped. This must be that plant you were talking about. Yeah. Saying hi. Where's the way out? And this is why we drill. In a straight line. Oh, there's definitely a house down here. Alright, musket boy, come on. Oh, those look like poison slimes. Okay. Are they green? They're purple. Purple? Hmm. Also one of these far- They're almost like farmers instead of actual enemies. Yeah, my pickaxe isn't good enough to get through this, unfortunately. Is it broken? Yeah, I gotta head back. Well, I can't pick the stuff up, so if you need the ore, grab that. Oh, yeah, I'll come down and grab the ore. I don't have the inventory space. Yeah, I'd say it's time for both of us to head back and do a massive unloading. Yeah, give me a second. Oh, I'm also noticing that... Um... I only have like uh, 30 health. You probably need to pick up on food while we're over here. I'm back. You're back already? Oh, you teleported, huh? Yeah, I made a recall orb. Maybe I should have done that. What do you need to make those? Uh, Like one mechanical part and one ancient gemstone. Oh, it's that's pretty simple. Yeah, we got line. plenty of those. On the left hand shrine, so uh, put you in here. Let's put some of these ores on charge. Where's my copper? Do I have any iron ore? Yeah, right here. This is the tin. And gold up here. Um, you don't use the mechanical arms for anything, but no, right? the, the crane doesn't use mechanical arms, it uses scarlet ore and iron. Sorry, scarlet bars and iron. Oh, I have an extra 10 pickaxe I can sell you. Oh, I got 10 pickaxes for days, man. Oh, I can sell the tall grass. I'm going to do that. Yeah, I know. I'm bringing my tall grass back to sell as well. I noticed that last time. You don't take the sand walls. I have like a thousand of those. I wish you could take. He does take them. He just doesn't pay you anything for them. Well, he does take them, but there's no point in doing it yet.
we need a better shovel than the wood one. I just don't really use it for anything. Uh, cleaning up the slime. I mean, it's just durability at that point. Then you yes, it is. Wood rather than using up the uh, the metals. Well, we're about to be rolling in metal, I think. I mean, we're already rolling in wood. I mean, I'm looking at the farm right now. That's definitely true. There's no question about that. I guess blocking one of the entrances into the house. Chest has the coins in them. Or do we not have a chest for that? We do. It's the treasure chest. It's got all of the treasures of the world. It's over here. Uh, it's the first one oh, here, yeah. right here. Oh, does that have ancient? Does it have coins in there? Yeah. Oh, does it not have coins? coins? Oh well, I mean, I have coins. I got seven hundred coins. There's seventy-one in there now. Okay, well, it's 771 in there. Nee, 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 nee. Uh, what do I need to repair the caveling gear? Fiber, okay. Right, I got lots of fiber right now. Oh, because these are broken. That's not... Okay, that makes sense, actually. Let's go sell a big haul. Hey, what's up, merchant friend? A battle axe, some tin, some grass, some more tin. 92 bucks, huh? Not bad. What else do I have? Ear plate, hard thorns, precious urn. For 82. It's even better than selling tin. And I don't even tell them where I get it. Where the tin dealer is. They don't know that I get it on Tinder. Okay, you say the left hand one does the recall teleport? Yeah, there we go. I'm just gonna build up a it's little the right collection. Item on the left hand tome. Do you just take damage? Uh, me? I'm hungry. Oh, do you take damage from hunger when you get to zero? I think so. I'm gonna eat some caveman bread. Uh, let's get that heart fruit and put it in with the carrot. And that's some big Mamed Shama healing and armor. I can't food. put the car rock with the recall idol. That's sad. Okay, question one. Why would you? Add teleportation to my food. <laughs> that would really be something, I think. That would really be you something. Just teleport back home. Well, you got me there. That is uh, certainly a thing. One could do all right we're at eight of ten on those um all right i got 91 torches now <laughs> fully stocked I eat real quick just to get me some. And just stock up on mushrooms real quick. You should be eating caveman bread. Yes, that's right, caveling bread. The best invention since switch cheese. Elvish whey bread. Just one bite is enough to 
fill the stomach of a grown man. <laughs> so as you might know, I've been re-watching Lord of the Rings, the extended edition. And there's an additional scene where Pippin and Merry eat four blocks of whey bread. <laughs> and then have to go to the bathroom afterwards. <laughs> Why? Because uh, they didn't know that one bite fills the stomach of a grown man. So, you know, they just eat a lot because they're halflings, a.k.a. random British people. Oh, every single click is giving me bonus bridges. Nice. Sick. Oh, is that your crafting? <laughs> yeah, my crafting's pretty good. I just hit 25 gardening and I got 38 crafting. All right. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Neat. Where is the electrical generator? <laughs> electrical wire. Drill. There. Robot arm. All right, let's say there's a theoretical maximum of eight drills around one of these bad boys. So that means it has a size of three on each side, which means you need to do uh, five, five, three, three, right? One, two, three, one, two, three, five, five. Okay, so that's... 16 outside edges, so you need 16 conveyor. Assuming we had the max number of drills, which we won't. Ooh, a gem crab. What sort of dark this, sciences are you doing? This rare crab has ancient gemstones glowing all over it. Well. Can be cooked. This is what happens when we let you do the science work. Absolute chaos. Oh, uh, you have these. Uh, I have to wait until that's done. I'll just put these in here for now. There's a live crab in the f in the chest next to the food. Okay. Careful grabbing the mushrooms; it might snap at you. Seven five is twelve. With twelve left, we could get a second bar, a second drill. Okay, and we could put two drills on one scarlet tap. And that'll get us a good amount. We've got 62 iron bars left over after that. So minus 10 will be 52. That's a good start. We'll have plenty of iron to play around with when we need to start doing the iron scarlet hybrid equipment. Like a nice scarlet pickaxe. Let's steal it. So there's not another layer of ranching, huh? We could both use a bigger backpack. Doesn't get much bigger. Got another gem crab. It's not very rare, I just got two in a row. Maybe you're just lucky. Azios has a liking for glimmering objects. Hmm. I wonder if that's a hint. Did we ever make one of these ancient hologram pods? No. I'm gonna make a couple. God damn. You good? Nah, I just missed the catch. Tried to rush it at the end and it cost me. Just fished up some kelp.
Oh. Oh my god. I'm sitting here wondering what this is, but it's literally called Large Shiny Glimmering Object, which means you need it in order to... Uh, we literally... <laughs> I wish I could say I planned this, but I didn't. So I talked to the the core, right? The core says Azios like shiny glimmering objects. I made this thing, and it allows you to make a large shiny glimmering object. And it gives you a scanner to scan for him. Azios the Sky Titan. Okay. We'll need to use that later. Can we pick this thing up? Copper, tin, iron, and scarlet. And gold. And yeah, ancient gems. You need them Basically all. Everything. We don't have any ancient feathers. Actually, we can just leave this here, right? There's no yeah, problem with that. This is the thing we need to use to build. Basically like having an extra trader. Let's make some seafood. My seafood, I eat it. Gem crab and an orange cave guppy. Stack. Yeah. Orange crab sushi. Plus 14 armor for 5 minutes, plus 8 mining damage for 5 minutes. And then let's mix you with the blue cave guppy. Let's see what kind of sushi I get here. He's about to get Inari sushi. The best Crash sushi. Energy. More armor, and this one gives dodge. Somehow you managed to get Alaskan shell crab underground in the jungle. And I got <laughs> gem crab. Blue crab is actually crabs from Maryland, interestingly enough. And I think you can catch them in Virginia as well. Yes, you can. They're in Chesapeake Bay. Chesapeake Bay. I know of it well. I am vaguely familiar with it. Well, you live in your state, so that makes sense. My state's Delaware. You don't have to try to hide that from the audience. They know where I live. Several audience, of them. Don't worry if he lives. Several of them really know where I live. <laughs> yeah, your address is. <laughs> oh, d d listen. Don't even <laughs> joke about doxing people. That's not cool, bro. I mean, again, I have actual real-life stalkers. I don't know what I did to deserve them. I'll put the orange crab sushi in the chest with the this. It gives it the mining stuff for you. Hmm. Okay. Um. I mean, I have another orb, so I don't need to make one yet. You already heading back over? Yeah, most of the way over, actually. You know, we should have left an update on the map. Can you talk to the map machine? Yeah, give me a second. I suppose you've been farther than I have, so it just makes sense that you're the one that should be making it happen. I think we've both been places the other hasn't. Really? Okay. I mean, I just kind of branch out a little bit farther than you when we do get to certain points. Two on each side, so I have actually... I made some miscalculations, but that's fine. Okay. I'm gonna have to go up, right? How do we make it turn? There we go. How much more do we need to make the drills right? What, like resource wise? I ha I'm setting two drills up right now. Oh, you're. Do you have chests for them? I have a chest, single chest. Uh, that'd be enough then. Just for this first rock, yeah. Or do you want from each drill? Uh, I, I, I'm going to try what some are calling a strategy. Oh, oh, and that's not actually what you want to do here. That's wrong. Because the drill will be against this. Yep, so if the drill's against this, then you want to go here. Get this bad boy up. I'll bring a spare chest just in case. That's a good plan. And like, um... Yes, perfect. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, it's intuitive. Interesting. Nope, 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 nope. It's like playing Space Engineers again. 
or satisfactory. Actually, it's closer to space engineers. Very interesting. Very, very interesting. So I'll be here. So I need to clear that out. Drill here. And there it is. That should work. Oh. There's some enemies alive down here. I guess we didn't go over there. Yeah, we didn't enter that area from anywhere yet. Just some guys just sitting in a piece of the cave we haven't touched yet. Brilliant. Absolutely genius. And we'll go drill, drill. Like just in case. But well, also. Yeah. Like that. Is it actually drill? Ah, there it is. It's working. It's working. This didn't actually pick it up though. How do I get you to work? We just put one of these along that entire line you made. Yeah, so you can see where the drills are going to go, right? You just stick them in the holes. The question is, why isn't the drill or why? Oh, <laughs> that answer is simple because I didn't power it with electricity and thus it is now auto mining. Well, there's nothing going on the conveyor belts. Not yet. I mean, it, it, the the mining takes a while, I think. Ooh, it hits you. You seem to have hurt yourself. Yeah, apparently, if you stand too close, it does damage after a while. You should probably stop hitting yourself. There it is. It happened. And it picked it up. Okay. We need to get a lot more Scarlet to speed this up. You know what I mean? I mean, it's nice that that'll be working whenever we're online, right? But we can't rely on that. Back, there'll be about five ore in there. Okay, yeah, I know. <laughs> uh, we haven't gone north yet, so let's try this. Someone out there is just going, yeah, but it's passive income. It is, technically. Would you accept a million dollars at uh, one time or a hundred dollars a week? And the passive income bros are just like, a hundred dollars a week, man. Passive income is the best. Well, I mean, it depends on how long you get the hundred No, it doesn't. If you have a million, no, that that's a deception. The million dollars, if you invest it wisely, is going to get you other. way more than a hundred a week. Yeah, most people don't invest money like that. Yeah, I they agree with you. Dollars. I I definitely have withheld money from the market for a long time because the market has been confusing and not straightforward. Uh, I did manage to invest some into my Vanguard fund, Windsor 2, at a pretty good time a few months back, right when it was in a dip. But yeah, I mean, you know, with 10% inflation, you really have to be investing quite smartly to beat the market right now. The market is definitely beating our asses. Not a great time. Not a great time economically. That's why I prefer virtual markets. That way I can lose fake money just as well as I lose real money. Well, I did get one ancient feather so we got something there what is this we, know we need those precious urn
So I think just breaking these yellow plants does give us stuff that we need. Give seeds. Well, that's how I got one of the um, ancient feathers was breaking one of those plants. Oh, shit, that hurt really badly. Poison slime. Well, well, well. You're really intent on coming home with me, poison slime. They're not spiky, so it may not be aggressive. They are not aggressive, but I did go and beat their asses, so, you know. Now, there's two scarlet ores up where I'm at. Well, mine them, bro. No, I'm talking about the drill spots. Oh my god, there's so many around here. Oh, there's also treasure um, wood chests that can break. Old chest killer Lawson, that's what they call him. Yep, chest killer Lawson, he loves chests. He just loves to get his hands on those chests. The 2x2 two two yellow plants are the ones you definitely want to break. Oh, fuck. I was wondering what happened. One of those goddamn plants grabbed me in the middle of a fight. Oh, boy. That's probably the intended effect. <laughs> I found another Scarlet Ore drill site. I found some in the wall here that I'm going to take. For a second. I should eat something. You probably should eat something. You really need to be taking better care of your health. But I ate before we started recording. <laughs> so did I. I finished up a deep dish pizza pie. It was great. Amore tried to eat it. She's up to her old tricks again. Is your cat the one that likes to climb in the oven? Yes, yes. She hasn't done it for years, but she did it today. I remembered a story about that. I couldn't remember if it was you or it was me. I watch. So kind of you to remember my stories, my anecdotes. Yes, that was indeed my precious, most beloved cat, Amore. Golden feather. You and these feathers, man. I was breaking these yellow pants and they gave you stuff. Like they've given me like tin ore. Sounds good to me. I don't know how I get that from a plant, but. Ah, this is a man who doesn't know about bog iron. Interesting. Now here's another um, scarlet mine where I'm at now for the drill. Got another butterfly. Oh, I ate that on a shield and I only took 26 damage. That's definitely how you're supposed to fight these guys. Well, one way. I guess the other way would be attacking from range or dodging. But I don't have that level of gumption. Oh, I like the swift feather. It makes dodging a lot easier. Well, you also have plus dodge equipment, so... Well, you literally actually... just evasion tank them. Well, I'm actually literally dodging through them with this yes, swift feather. I agree that you do that. Because you can move through the enemies with that and, like, just regular walking. You can be a knight in chess. Uh, I have 16 Scarlet Ore. Pretty good. Screw your passive income. I got punched already. Oh, here's more right here. And that farmer dude's blocked by all the woods, so he can't get to me. And here's more. Look, it's a supplemental source, okay? It pays out dividends longer over time. The more we play, the more valuable it is. Right now. What? 
I built all the way into the wall all across the map, bro. You have you to commit. You, you got the better mining score. That's true, but that's because that's my thing. If you want to come down here and mine, you can go ahead and do it. You go. You you do it. You think you're gonna get better at mining by not mining? Forget about it. I mean, this most isn't of my mining comes from me breaking sand walls. <laughs> this isn't how I raised you. <laughs> you didn't raise me, Dad. That's <laughs> true. That'd be a good bit, though. Well, you want to get James to run a show so he can play father-son character? No, please, no. I'm just glad you called me dad instead of mom in that case. Rad was making fun of my character for wanting to be everybody's mom when I made Caratina. Speaking of Caratina, man, it was so weird that Fryren basically turned out to be Caratina. And also, Fryrun is, like, turning out to be one of the best mangas ever made. You know you can help me, right? I am. I'm holding up a torch. <laughs> God. <laughs> what a smartass. I didn't raise you to be like this. actually much faster than doing it solo there's probably some enemies over here need bridges I got bridges need bridges I can't mine I'm working on it. You're slacking off. You're the one slacking off. Imagine walking around in this game without bridges. That's all I'm saying. Oh, is this a new area? Ooh, what the heck are those? I'm gonna bet that this is the, um, the mold area, or moss, or whatever it is. Oh boy, there are definitely dudes here. That took about five or six hits. They stand next to each other, they can have both at the same time. What is this? Oh, Swift Feather, huh? Wow, they have a lot of health, man. Yeah, they do. Which is why I'm glad we can do this. Oh, what the hell? You look like you got stunned. I got shot by something. Something's shooting at me. Must have hit something with a range attack. No, I can see it. If you come up here, it's a structure. Oh. Yeah, you see it? You got the angle on it? Shoot down my fireball lane. Yep, I got it, I got it. It did, like, most of my health bar, so... I guess I'm gonna eat first before something else gets shot at me. No, I got them all. They're all down. Hey, you have a faster attack speed than me. That's because I'm higher level. Yeah, we desynced for sure. If I can actually hit him. I hope we're getting a ton of experience for how much damage these things have to take. Ain't no walk in the park, that's for sure. Dropped ancient coin. I don't know that all of this was worth one ancient coin. You building now? Yeah, probably to my detriment, but here we go. Oh, fuck. It came at me. Something shot at you. Something shot at you. There's another structure somewhere. Yeah, I see it. Yeah, 
Either their respawn speed is like juiced But there are still yet more of them over here Holy shit, dude, they just keep coming I actually said dodge on it, so Oh no, it got me, it got me with the Oh no, oh This is so fucking weird. Yeah, I gotta back off for sure. <sighs> uh, there's... Oh, this slows you down. If you stop on it too long. What the heck? There's a chest. <clears throat> We were able to force our way past those guys, but now that, you know, it's such close quarters, and it's not really safe. For an extended period, it gets to a stacking slow detriment. Oh, interesting. It might just be these things. Oh, Mr. I don't need a shovel. I'm trying to see. Oh, no, it's just in general, the mold slows you down if you stand on it too long. What's to four stacks? Five stacks. Six what stacks. Is this called? Can't find it in my inventory. It might not give you anything. Oh, that's true. Oh, I have eight stacks, minus fifty percent move it speed. Away pretty quickly once you get off, but yeah, but that's nasty. It's like seven percent per stack. This is probably just called Mold Wall. After I get this next bit of Scarlet, I'm going to head back, check the chest, see how much has been mined up while we're gone, and then uh, teleport back to base. Yeah, it's because all that new stuff we got in Moldland. That and having every swift feather that's ever been crafted. I would keep one in your inventory just for combat reasons. That's pretty clunky to swap in and out. I prefer what I've got, which is the shield. Oh, you have a shield, that's right. I've yeah, the shield now. massively reduces incoming damage if you can time it. There's more mold up here, okay. I like how it's just like a light blue on the map. It's a very nice color. The mold? Yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah. I finally heard someone use simp as an insult today. I was watching Peacemaker with John Cena. You mean Twitch was justified? I mean, I think you have to be real fucking stupid to use simp as an insult, so... I don't know. No comment on uh, Twitch rules enforcement. How about that? Sounds like a good idea from your perspective. Let Bartlett be Bartlett. Oh, yeah, there's enemies over here. I forgot about that. I can still get this before they can see me, so. Wait, what the heck is this? Can I move? Get rid of stone wall. Oh, petrified coral. The ocean it belonged to seems long gone. It was to his 10 ore mine while we were gone. That's not the worst. I'm bringing my 26 ores back. That's a good amount. I just have to one up the. All right, put your twenty six in one. I'm gonna put my sixty in the other. I'm gonna just let them uh, cook at the same time. Uh, I have other ores as well. Yeah. Guess it doesn't really matter what I put in this one. It's empty. 
Oh, you emptied all of these. Yep. What's this gold feather? I just... Oh, it's just golden feather. Valuable. I got plenty of things to sell, then. Ooh, 75. Nice. Uh, grass walls. Give me anything. I don't need to sell the mechanical part, actually. Um, I can sell the bush. Sell the tall grass. Get you a lot of things you can just have no use for. Ooh, Dry Butterfly. 230 credits, and I got 10 of them. Oh, that's how much for 10 of them. Okay. Oh, the hard thorn. It just calls these valuables that we can sell, but I feel like there should be another use for them. I don't disagree with you, but, you know, from everything I've seen, that's not true. You pretty much just sell them. If you want to commit the forbidden arts, you can always Google it. It's not like we haven't Googled something here before. I mean, you have. It's true. I did. The strategy for beating Gorm. Just even getting in contact with Gorm. Speaking of Gorm, I just bought his summoning idol. You're insane. He's a madman. What is that? Green stuff above us, or is that just the fireflies? Okay. I would have saved up for rune parchment so that we can make whatever rune parchment is. It says it's a weapon. Yeah. A unusually well preserved piece of ancient paper, which is a weird way to write. The runes are impossible to decipher, but small symbols hint at it being the recipe for a strange weapon. 2K. I got 294. I think we're close to a thousand at least. Or over a thousand, probably. Okay, what do you want to do with this round of Scarlet Ore? Did you say you were getting something called Ancient Feathers? I have... I thought I picked up multiples, but I only have one. Okay. Oh, I picked up a Golden Feather, that's right. I have one Ancient Feather. We need... Yeah, I saw that. Yeah, for the scanner, we need ten of them. All right, I'm going to put that in this chest. Three Ancient Gemstones. I found a cave pouch. That's not enough inventory space anymore. Correct. Do you buy my cave pouch? Mm -hmm. Six. We do have a full stack of 999 of the ancient coins. And okay. another stack of over 100. Well, just keep saving. Okay, we've got the large, shiny, glimmering object, which I think will be needed to get Azios to fight us. Just, you know, it, in, it is implied. So, do you... Oh, oh, I have new running skills, huh? Plus 3% damage after running, or reduce snare and stand. Oh, wow, this 10-pack axe just destroys these walls now. Well, I mean, what do you, do you want to build more drills or do you want to start investing in like scarlet pickaxes and scarlet swords? Um, how much scar we have like 40 scarlet? Mm, when it's all done, it's not ready yet, but when it's all done, it should be closer to like 80. Uh, we can, we can, get you a, can make a scarlet gear for yourself and then we can work on the. I mean, I think what we should get is two scarlet pickaxes. Scarlet yeah, we both get scarlet pickaxes because it seems like those moss wall or mold walls are going to be hard to get through and you like exploring. We also both get scarlet backpacks for 15 inventory spots. 
and then we'll make an anvil and see what we get off of that. How's that sound? Um, oh, I leveled up. We already have this automation table. Is that what this is? Is this automation table? Yeah, I feel like that must be it. We also need poison slime, so make sure to bring those back intact. I have not fought one yet. So close to range 10. Let me go see if I can level that on some slimes real quick. I first slime I kill, I get range 10. Nice. Yeah, that gives me 4% range attack speed. Does that show up on my. No, it doesn't. Speaking of which, I should probably repair my fire staff before I go away. Okay, let's heal up. And you may want to re restock the farm. Mm, I feel like we've got tons of food, am I wrong? I mean, just have the berries growing. Alright, okay. When we get low, we can start grabbing them again. I was thinking we may want to set up a automatic wood farmer that will just harvest a little bit of wood for us constantly, but we seem to just have so much of it. This hardly really seems worth it. Top down Minecraft. <laughs> I think I level up farming just from breaking all this stuff anyway, so. You see that uh, crony kicked everyone out of the bunkeroni. She put new security measures in to hide it from the eyes of the world. Gonna either be she doing was, a bit or doing something really big. I think she's doing something really big. She was very impressed with Muna's automation and secret prison. Muna is apparently trying to uh, harvest villagers. Well, Muna did a lot of that stuff on the JP server when she was working with Pecora. Well, I mean, if you're talking about war crimes, you're definitely talking about Pecora. Con, pico, con, pico, con, pico, con. Live YouTuber number one war criminal Usada Picora Des. Uh, oh, I, I looked over and I saw the Pecora merch I have in my office. You're a monster. From the How baseball dare game. you support such a horrendous mass murderer? And then I look over and I see the Subaru merch. I cleared out some more slimes. So that's good. Uh, I should update the map. Okay. The metals chest has your scarlet pickaxe in it. That's the first one here? Yeah. Yes. Looks more like a scythe than a pickaxe. At least from the angle it shows. Alright, I'm about to get your sword. Not that you use swords sword. much, but what? Why'd you make a sword? Well, if you don't want a sword, you can just take a backpack then. Here you go. It is in the metals chest. And I just hit crafting 40. Sick. Let me repair some of my stuff. Oh, I just got rid of all my wood. 
I need the wood to repair my fire staff. Oh, you built a wall over here? Over where? By where the, um, the slime spawn is? The big slime spawn? Yes, I wanted to keep them out. So they wouldn't kill our NPCs. You didn't even put a door here, you just put a torch here. <laughs> yeah, but what are, like, what are the odds that they're actually going to make it through that area? It's pretty low. Well, I mean, there's slimes on the right of it, so... Yeah, but it's only like one compared to like the 20 over here. Look. If you want to pick the torch up and put a door down, be my guest. Also, I'm saying it is a little confusing. It l lowered the probability of them appearing, okay? There's much fewer of them now. And it doesn't seem like they're hostile to the NPCs. Jack Shepherd in. That's probably where we need to put a drill is on the tin. Killing an enemy increases critical hit chance by 3% up to 5 stacks. The armor has plus 2, 4, and 3. So 2, 3, 4 is going to end up being 9, plus 15 is 24% critical chance, plus the sword's own critical chance of 11%. That's 36. So it's basically like 1 crit every second as long as you're swiping at max speed. Mm. Mm. 12 armor, 16, 19. Yeah, it's an increase in armor size as well. So you get lower base damage, but a much higher chance to crit. I don't know what crits do, are they just two per Double damage? No clue. No clue. I mean, it's probably a some kind of damage boost. You still have a Scarlet Shell backpack, by the way, that you haven't picked up. Yeah, I'm not really that worried about it right now. Eh, you seem like I'm the one running out of inventory space. You're the one exploring. I'm Explo also all the way to the left right now. I'm not doing anything. To the left? Yet. Interesting. I'm just breaking through some walls, seeing what's around the base. Well, if you, you know, 
If you find some tin, we could use it. Um, I got one copper. I've got an ogre slaying knife. I got one copper. I don't think I'm not going far enough for ten, I don't think. Plus nine to slaying ogres. Do you want to stick to just mining Scarlet, or do you want to get, like, a, a mine for everything going? Uh, I don't know. We, I mean, so the thing is, right, like, I just spent almost all the Scarlet just getting us these equipment upgrades. The sword is nice. I mean, it deals basically... Oh, that was a crit. So my crit looks like it dealt 50% more damage. Interesting. Uh, I mean, this thing does less alpha damage. You know what I mean? Like, the battle axe had a stronger first swipe. But it gets to attack almost twice as fast. And I feel like that is a strong incentive to keep using it. And of course, I'm hoping that the Scarlet Pickaxe would be a very serious upgrade. But the cards. I mean, what do you think in terms of? I mean, what do we really need other than scarlet and maybe We're gold? Right? Tons of iron right now. So I think gold would be for the jewelry bench. I don't know that we need more jewelry right now, although we certainly could do it. I think you want to build specific sets for specific fights, I guess, is one sure. reason. Where am I at again? Oh. Secret Star Wars group got to meet last week, which was great, but we don't get to meet this week. Which is not as great. So what I'm hearing is we're going in on extra long eight hours. No, 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 no. He's insane, audience. He's a madman. We got like we got, the night. we got like 35 minutes left. Can't you enjoy the time that we have now? Gandalf has a you whole speech enjoy about more this. Time? I mean. I have other things I have to do. Thank Isn't you. two hours a week for a specific game? Doesn't it make you look forward to playing it the next week? We have a very specific goal, more Scarlet. We accomplished it. We've beaten bosses. We beat two bosses in one week. That was pretty dope. We did beat them five feet apart from each other, too. <laughs> It's not the distance between their hearts, but the distance between their difficulty ratings. I'm pretty sure we... they don't have any more hearts left, so... It's a whole kingdom full of hearts.
You make a scarlet fishing rod. Sure. We've got the materials. Go ahead. Treat yourself. I'm not going to make a scarlet fishing rod. Treat yourself. What are fishing rods for if not for friendship and getting the best food in the game? Aren't you ready for the new fishing anime? I'm actually kind of surprised there isn't a fishing anime. Is it just not a popular sport or pastime in Japan? I feel like it has to be. I mean, their whole culture is based around fishing. Is it just too hard to make fishing cool? That can't be true either. Fishing is very cool. Just leaving it for someone else to figure out. For someone else to throw in all the chests. Sure. I've got elite executive decisions to make here. sound like something I'd say. What about seven days to die? What if we did that again in like three or four months? I haven't played that one before. Oh, that's right. You weren't part of the last seven days group. That's pretty wild. We had some good times. Like when we blew up our own bridge for no real reason. we created the murder den all right let's see how much faster this is i think we did already have an ancient hologram pod because i found one in a chest uh i, I made two of them because i didn't know what they did and i left oh. the chest one out oh no come over here do you have a um okay, we'll take that one and go i'm right behind you so don't stop Perfect. One day this will stretch all the way to the end of the road. Can't look while it's moving. Come on, hit him. Go, Nido King. Do not pick up your wood, your walls. <laughs> you don't Do like picking up my up garbage? I do not need to pick up your stack of 70 sand walls. Why did you take three hits with the sword? Hey, 
Hey, new melee combo point available. Up to 6% melee attack speed. Um, these give me health regen? Yeah. And armor. For the best. So do you want to explore the mold tonight? I don't know. Like, I feel like we need to get some really serious armor before we go in there, man. They hit pretty dang hard, and there's lots of them. But if you want to take, like, a little toe dip, I guess, let's do it. Let's get salient. Sorry, I'm just clearing the path for the future railway construction. You know. I'm doing my favorite core keeper pastime, breaking sand. That does sound like you. You son of a bitch, I'm in. I wanna get it over here and break the sand. <laughs> Easiest way to level up mining, too. The easiest way to level up mining is to mine. Sometimes the real mining is the friends we made along the way. It's just one crunchy mushroom soup. I mean, if you need I'll take, it. I'll take, the, I'll take the free points in cooking. <laughs> just picking up your cooked dishes gives me that, apparently. This is wilderness. I mean, we may just find the boss without even having to get the tracker. It is possible, I guess, but. This seems like a really big area. I mean, it encircles the area already encircled. So, yes. And the mold part is considered part of his wilderness, too to the map. Is it now? Unless it's just telling me that's where I'm at right now. Oh, it might just be telling me that's where I'm at. Okay.
we get a rail line this far, we've done something very right. Yes. There was 14 Scarlet waiting in that chest. I mean, it's pretty good for we go home, we come back. 14 Scarlet, it's enough to make another drill. Is that passive income? I like how there's still chunks of your path that aren't on my map, but I just walk through them and fill it out. Just shows I'm going the long way around. Oh, wow. I can't get through the, even with the Scarlet pickaxe, can't get through the mold walls. It's not even giving me a marker. Ignore the fact that the first fireball is more at you than the enemy. Yeah, I know. I got a new vitality point. Alright, there's gonna be a shooter around this corner. Oh god, the debuff is, the debuff is stacking so badly. Oh, fuck, I need help, bro. Oh, shit. Behind you. <laughs> there. He was I mean, one shot away, too. I was down to like 2 or 3% hit point. It was not going well. It looks like the um swift feather ignores the speed debuff, by the way. So you might want to have one just to move around this area. Interesting. Maybe that's why they were dropping like crazy. Did you leave your minecart on the mining line? Well, I didn't bring a recall orb this time, so I'm going to need it. Ooh, got I mean, I, I have a bunch of recall orbs. I'll give you some when I get back. Okay, that's something I got out of a wall. I just feel like it's a good idea to keep a minecart in your inventory from now on. Just to speed yeah. up your run back. You know, let you zoom past. I don't know how fast you are, but I don't know that you're faster than a minecart. Once we get a bunch of tin, we can really extend that line. Yeah, this Scarlet does not do anything to that wall, apparently. 50 wax and not even a crack in the wall. I mean, I told you earlier. I was doing my own testing. All right, well, as long as it's means tested. I just feel like I could just open this game up while I'm GM prepping. I'll tab it out and just let the auto miners out of mine. Talk to me about auto playing Ark Knights. <laughs> and then come with that. Yeah, the difference is, is that we had to work to get to this point. And Ark Knights is literally. I had to work to kill 400 enemies in one go so I could get the auto mission. Ooh, well, I enemies. You gonna follow me? Yep, you are. Okay. 
Wow, you just let me pick up my equipment first, Jesus. Oh, fucking shit. I wasn't talking about you when I said follow me. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna be alright if I take more hits like that. Alright, hold on a sec. I'll try to make sure this guy doesn't hit you. This is a recall orb. In fact. Well, I need one at a time, so. Yeah, but here's three more. So I feel like you're not going to make them and you're going to forget. Mm, is there any more to the north? Yeah, there's... Got him. Three Scarlet Ore in this chest. Not bad. I got a mold-covered chest. A fungi seed. Uh, there's, probably, there's definitely more enemies to the left. Ooh, hi. I'm guessing these are mold-covered cablings. First, I thought they were like a crab-like enemy, but they definitely look like the cave that's covered in mold. I'm seeing it now that you've mentioned it. Because they have the same exact noises, too, which... Only they had some good loot. My staff's almost broken, by the way. Yeah. There's some watchers. Oh, I'm fucked. I never should have questioned you playing Arknights. I was wrong. And you were right. Play all the Arknights you want. Plus one VIT, plus one ranged. You know, I thought I was going to play Nikkei, but the more I see the game, the less I like it. I think I'm going to skip. I haven't seen anything from the game in a while now, actually. What? No, it, it does a new, like hero every like three or four days on their twitter account follow their twitter account what i don't follow their twitter well i don't anymore either they, they kept releasing heroes and i was like all right i don't like the look of these young women mostly because they're very young women well i only saw what kamaniki retweeted so Or there's older women in Arknights. I'm not playing Arknights, though. And second off, how dare you call them old women? Not that, you know, there's anything wrong with being an old woman, but I'm pretty sure what you mean by old woman and what I mean by old woman are differentiated by about 30 years. In the canon, your ex-wife, so... <laughs> ex-wife? Aren't you supposed to be like a teenager? No. Oh. You're like a world-renowned strategist. I thought you were a doctor. I mean, you are a doctor, but you're the game makes a point that you're really well known for your being a strategist. They must not know me very well. At least the main story, the side missions and stuff don't really bother with that. I mean, what's the point of side missions if they don't expand on the lore? FGO! They, do, they, just don't they just don't expand on your lore. The main story is the only one that touches on the doctor's lore. All right. Everything else is like world building and side characters. It's only one person who I accept of be is being called the doctor. And that's Gregory House. Um... I can get rid of some of these. Oh no, the stacking is starting. It hurts. 
Jesus. I really just took that hit for you, huh? Don't worry, I got hit too. <laughs> Oh, there's spawns behind us. Oh, I didn't realize I was low on health. You dead? Yeah. That's very spawning bad. Spawning from the walls. Oh, that's good. That's halfway there. Oh, something destroyed all these torches, or are they not spawning in for me? Oh, no, you put them into the walls. I clipped them into the walls so that... We could make a straight line of rail later when we've got it. Why can't I see anymore? <sighs> you don't need sight. Just walk in a straight line. That's why I invested so much time and opportunity into this. And then you put the conveyor belt right in the middle of that line. Yeah, well, I didn't make the conveyor belt spawn there. Bro, I'm trying my best here. Not everything works out all the time. Sometimes perfection can't be achieved. You just have to work with what you've got. You know, theoretically, we could teleport over here in a way. As long as we don't need anything in our back room. Of our backpack. We could set up beds over here and just have the slimes kill us whenever we want to come over. It's not teleporting, though. You've been watching too many isekais. And technically, it's teleporting. You die and you spawn all the way over here by the molts. It's a kind of teleporting. You've you've been brainwashed by isekai. I'm pretty sure in an isekai, I would wake up and we'd be playing Minecraft. This we. I don't want to fucking play Minecraft in an isekai. That's horrifying. It's fucking endless falling. Dragons. Laser dudes. Drowning. Constantly betrayed by my own friends. Some guy named Steve. Oh, my shield did not get up in time. Fuck. Is there a right. launcher up there? No, I just... I've been doing this new strategy where I intentionally take the hit and then I just counterattack like insane fast. Alright. I need a bed. Do I have yarn somewhere? Oh, my headpiece broke. <laughs> None of this is good. Definitely plenty of fiber up here. New point in running. At least I got something out of this mold. Scarlet Sword. I got that for free. Nice. You got that for free? It was in one of the chests. Jesus. Chipped plate. And a blowpipe. I also Plus picked up a blowpipe. 16% chance to apply poison. The range weapon? Yeah. Reduces enemy healing received by 75%. I do not need enemies that can heal. Yeah, but we know it. We know bosses can heal, though. Oh, well, that's true. Yeah, I feel like that's the kind of thing you use to go back and fight earlier bosses. Holy cow, there's like three of them that just spawn behind me and they're coming at me. I told you that they, they spawn in the rear area. 
Told you about those stairs, bro. Keeps happening. Oh, wow. There's like seven of them. Yeah, I'm glad I got the swift... The swift um, feather, because that just saved my life. Man. Imagine a feather saving your life. Well, if I didn't have it, then I was blocked in, because they... I was going to just say, a one by one path. look, there's a great Anubis reference somewhere there. What was that? I just fell. Oh, no, it fell. <sighs> My old person drink mix. All right, I killed them all. All right, I'm bringing a bed to somewhere nearby. Not mine. Oops. Was it the first, the closer one? No, that was quite distant. But this is definitely yours. Where the treasure chest was, then that was yours. Oh fuck. I mean, I don't really have anything in there that's important. No, it was like to me. blue crab sushi and all sorts of other shit. Oh yeah, that was definitely in mine. But yep, you can have it. I'm not gonna have it. I'm gonna drop it all for you to take back. Just as soon as I live. And recover. And get my own goddamn shit. Hey, look, a bed. What sort of incredible genius made that? Now that must have been the first time I died, because I just picked up my newest one. Oh, there's still enemies still. Now we did... Okay, so the tentacles respond too. Sounds right to me. Did you say my stuff's back here? Yeah, hold on, hold on. Let me get this, let me get this. Okay. This chest holds what I believe to be yours. Most of it, anyway. Now the gooey stone dip snack is yours. Okay. It's my iron pickaxe. Uh, that's probably your iron pickaxe. That lantern's mine. Uh, fiber. I mean, you could have taken the fiber and the other stuff. Take it. Take it. There's enemies coming behind us. Or one guy that just spawned. Put your recall idols in, in the thing again. And this is probably your... No. Only your fishing rod. I mean, I still have a base there because I had too much stuff. You know, I had your full inventory of mine. It wasn't going to work out. I'm going to pick it up when you're done. I'm going to pick this up. Wait, poison me. What a son of a bitch. Oh, 
Am I safe to leave? Yes. AP Gaming Girl is now playing Core Keeper. I've been playing Core Keeper. Well, Steam wanted to let me know, so. Okay. I feel like you should set up a bed here. You probably have the materials. I do not have the materials. I wow. There's wood all around us. I'm literally rolling in wood right now. How much wood do I have? Okay. More wood than you just had. Making a bed. I can see my eyes close. Can't eat while I'm sleeping. <laughs> That's true. That's a notable fact. Okay, so the fungi look interesting for cooking purposes. That sounds so dangerous. Well, the, oh, the fuck. buff fungi right now gives you plus five food, minus 23 health. Well, I mean, the bomb pepper also gives you minus health, right? But when you cook it with stuff, it turns yeah, out to be pretty good. It says a moldy fungus fit for gourmets. So that sounds a little promising, I guess. And we're kind of at a dead end here until we can. I mean, I'm forcing my way forward. I mean, just in general, we're kind of at a dead end until we can break the fungus walls. Mold walls. Do we know what we need to do that? Not yet. Fuck, you got me. Oh, I got the shield block off. <laughs> Suck it. Suck it, loser, I say, while running away. He's dead, don't worry. I mean, I'm still leaving. I'm poisoned. Can't afford to get one tap from behind. missed you how the heck i think we have to farm the Azios wildlands for those ancient feathers so we can get the uh boss tracker yeah it's a task for next week okay yeah this mold area is still part of the wildland the wilderness yeah but i mean we we're having a lot of trouble making significant progress, and it definitely seems like uh, <laughs> Feather would be a lot more straightforward. All right, you ready to call it? Let me update the map. All the stuff I did over here. Wow, that's opened up a lot over there, actually. Gotta open up some down here this area. That's a big chunk of this first area we didn't explore. Oh, I found a fisherman enemy. Fisherman enemy? Yep. Just like I said. Well, how can you tell he's a fisherman? He's carrying a fishing pole. Ah. What did, what did you think when I said fisherman? The guy with a fishing rod, that, right? To be honest. I figured some dude threw a magic carp at you. <laughs> magic carp? Hit him with the splash attack. All right, magic carp. 
Um, got some tin ore I can throw in here. It's the copper. There's the tin. Put these chests down somewhere. Oh, there's a slime in your farm. That's fine. Slimes are harmless. You got any closing thoughts for the audience today? Bold is very annoying. Okay, well, anyone who's ever had a shower agrees with you. Unless I'm trying to make a bold statement. You mean a bold mold statement? Or a mold bold statement? Sell these real quick. I, just, I found something over here. What the fuck is this, dude? It's like a giant titan holding... Holding a gem. Ancient Guardian's Necklace. 17% reduced damage from bosses. Okay, thanks. That sounds like very situational, but very good item. Oh, I have to change out my plus 10% damage. That's fine. Minus 20% incoming damage. Pretty damn good. No closing thoughts for today? I mean, there's not really much to add. You could say use bombs wisely. We didn't uh, use any bombs this episode. You could say always make sure to use your powers for good. Treat your cavelings well, otherwise they'll end up covered in mold. Okay, that's true. Okay, so Scarlet Sword goes All right, you got your everything? Yep, I'm just walking back over. I got stuff in my inventory, so I can't just let the slimes kill me. <laughs>